Today we are exploring the world of temporary power by comparing this petrol generator to the Anker Solix F2000 portable battery pack. As electricians we provide the miracle of electricity to homes and buildings every day. Still there are times we need to turn the power off and leave the customers without that other essential in life. Wi-Fi. When working on a chilly construction site and needing a cuppa, a hot meal or charging power tool batteries, a dependable temporary power source is indispensable. Is this battery pack a practical substitution for a petrol generator? We visited our local hire centre to collect a 1kVA petrol generator. Anker provided the battery power station, a well-known brand to us here at eFix, particularly behind the scenes. We rely on Anker USB power supplies, battery packs and cables for all our devices it's interesting to see how they are now moving to provide bigger power solutions so let's have a look at the tech specs the generator can supply a peak load of 1000 volt amps or 900 volt amps on continuous load. The Anker Solix F2000 can supply a maximum output of 2300 watts. The generator will provide its rated power output of 900 watts for 3 hours and 54 minutes. The Anker Solix F2000 features a power storage capacity of 2048 watt hours, allowing it to provide 900 watts of power for just over 2 hours. To double the battery capacity, simply attach an expansion pack to the rear of the unit. The generator is fueled by a highly flammable, expensive chemical that must be purchased from a specialist fuel station and carried in a special holder. The Anker Solix F2000 can be refuelled by plugging it into a regular cheap AC mains power and will recharge to 80% in just one hour. You can also refuel using the Anker solar panels or by plugging it into your van's accessory port. Due to the emissions of the toxic fumes, the generator should be positioned outside the building during operation. Avoid leaving it unattended to prevent potential theft. Use an extension lead to provide power to the workplace. The Anker Solix F2000 emits no harmful fumes and can be conveniently placed wherever you're working. It also features a useful light with three brightness levels to illuminate your workplace. The generator signals running out of fuel by going silent and no longer providing power. The Anker Solix F2000 has a clear LCD display showing the exact power loading and remaining power capacity. You can also access this data using your handy mobile phone app which also lets you configure lots of other useful settings. When you need emergency power you'll need to run outside and start that generator by pulling a piece of string. The Anker Solix F2000 can operate in UPS mode providing emergency power within 20 milliseconds of power outages. The generator makes quite a bit of noise when running. The Anker Solix F2000 operates silently when discharging the battery. The app allows you to activate silent charging modes to eliminate fan noise while charging. When fueled, the generator weighs 15.5 kilos. It has a handy carry handle, leaving your other hand free to carry the fuel can. The Anker Solix F2000 weighs 30.5 kg, has durable wheels, and has an easy tow retractable handle, leaving your other hand free to carry your tools and food. The generator has a five year warranty provided you take it back to your dealer every year for a service and replace some parts. The Anker Solix F2000 has a five year guarantee and doesn't need a yearly service. Its EV grade lithium ion phosphate batteries are reliable for 3000 charge cycles equivalent to 10 years of use. Well, tech specs are one thing, what does this mean in the real world? Time for lunch. It's Tuesday, which means Gary's on tomatoes and toast. First, let's boil one and a half litres of water with a two kilowatt kettle so we can make the team a brew. Next up, warm the tin of tomatoes in a one and a half kilowatt microwave, followed by four slices of brown toast in a one kilowatt toaster. That's Gary's lunch sorted with 70% of the battery capacity remaining. So if you're not practicing for an appearance on MasterChef and prefer just to warm up a few Greg's pasties for a few minutes in the microwave, that's everyone's lunch sorted with 73% battery remaining. Over the years, we've spent a small fortune on battery powered kitchen gadgets, such as microwaves, fridges, and kettles. With the Anker Solix F2000, you can use standard mains appliances to enjoy hot and cold drinks on site. Next up, recharge some power tool batteries. 
Power tool batteries can be quite costly, therefore the ability to swiftly charge them on site is a significant advantage reducing the need to carry numerous batteries. By using the multiple 13 amp socket outlets we can connect various power tool chargers keeping all trades satisfied and earning goodwill from the plumbers. Additionally the unit is equipped with a range of USB-C and A outlets with three USB-C outlets that can support up to 100 watts per socket. This allows us to recharge electronic devices like phones, tablets and laptops at the same time as charging the power tools. We've charged a combination of batteries with a total capacity of around 550 watt hours. After that the charge capacity is 44% more than enough to boil the kettle for an afternoon tea break. Returning home at night, it's a swift process to recharge. Simply plug in the mains cord to the IEC inlet and this unit charges at 2.2 kilowatts. This allows you to go from 44% to 100% in about an hour, preparing you for another bustling day. Now let's talk about the cost. I've included a link to the Anchor website in the description for further details on the product and pricing and dependent on when you watch this video there may be an ongoing promotion. This unit is around twice the price of the petrol generator and considerably less than the amount we've spent on battery powered cooking gadgets and batteries Yet, the initial expense is just the beginning. Refilling the petrol generator costs about £4 each time, amounting to hundreds of pounds annually. Additionally, there is an upkeep of adding the oil and scheduling a yearly service. What are your thoughts on the Anchor Solix F2000 portable battery pack? Perhaps I've missed something. Let me know in the comments, but for more informative videos, shoot across here. But till then, I'll see you on the flip side. Ta-da.